What is up? This is Adric with Adric Motor Works. Just giving a update on things and beginning a project, so I wanted to get it on video. We got Cordell over here finishing up, putting this Subaru motor back together for this guy. Came in with rod knock. Uh, he wanted he went and bought an eBay short block and then bought some heads from a junkyard and the heads had bent valves because his heads had original cracks in them. And then the cams that were in it weren't usable. And then one of the cam caps with the cam angle sensor was broken off. Where's that at? The thing is over here somewhere. But basically it was unusable. And then he brought us a turbo, which is not the same turbo. So <laughs> this is a piece together build and I hate doing it like that. With the amount of money he spent already, he probably could have just had an IAG block. We got Hans over here getting ready to get started on the GTO, throwing the Texas Speed motor in. <laughs> we are, he's draining the fluids right now and then this thing's gonna be yanked out today. And then I am about to dive in on some electrical diag on this Jeep. Fun stuff, the dome lights stay on forever, so. So today is coming to a close ish five o'clock I think ish um, we got a lot done today uh, as you can see the motor and transmission are out of the GTO and then Subaru motor you got the exhaust and turbo back on and of course one of the studs that we're trying to replace is being impossible so Dealing with that, I looked at the Jeep, um, figured out a dome light issue, tracked it back to a short in the body control module, but figured out a way to bypass it, so that's cool. Um, but also doing a radiator on it because it's leaking, uh, oil pan gasket and differential gasket and some new fluids. And Cordell is over here. <clears throat> He's been working on, he got the new top hats on these new coilovers and the new bottom horseshoes on. Or the freshened up ones, I should say. They're the original ones from the car that we just freshened up and then got these new coilovers and then some new Moog goodies, control arms, ball joints, everything. Hey guys, so uh, it is the end of the day here. It's actually later than the end of the day. The guys went home at like six-ish um because that's time, what time we close uh it's like almost eight now i think uh I had to finish up some stuff in the office and then i took care of some stuff on this jeep i got the oil pan off which i'll show you got the oil pan off here um chilling on the parts washer gonna deal with it tomorrow um also in there i have the rear diff cover and all the bolts and stuff too um, this Jeep doing a, it had a differential leak on it. So I cleaned up the gasket surface, um, on this oil pan, it was a pain in the butt just cause you have to take the motor mounts off the mounts and raise it. Not really a pain in the butt, just not fun, <laughs> not easy. Um, and then the radiator, I just needed to drain it and then bring it out tomorrow for the new one that about sums it up for today um we'll come back at it hard tomorrow in the morning uh thanks for watching and come back and see what other kind of stuff we get into tomorrow uh subscribe like thanks